Welcome, welcome to the stream tonight. We have AHL Hershey Bears playing against the Henderson Silver Knights in game one tonight. Hershey Bears coming in at 5-3-1 from last week with the Silver Knights 5-4. Silver Knights opting to mix up their line tonight and uh, Bears sticking with their last uh, week's Monday, rather Sunday night line. So it should be a pretty even matchup. You can see the lineups there uh, on your top of your screen. We're gonna be cutting it over to game uh, play by play in just a second here as this game gets started. Back, Here's game one. Hershey Bears rocking their nice chocolate brown unis with the Silver Knights in white. You're going to have the bears on your bottom right. Top of the screen will be the Silver Knights. Waldo facing off against Tom Tom here in the dot. So what's, what's up, Sweet Lou? What's up, guys? The tie up there to start. Waldo up the middle to Mino from Fist. Almost gets it started off right. Defense putting enough pressure there on Mino to take that away. And Henderson going the other way. Evoxity taking it down the boards to Demers. And Howler's going to take that away. He's streaking, finds Mino. Oh, actually, back to Fist. A nice shot over at the point there from Mino. Good save by Jay Philly, who's back in net there for the Knights. Smoke, Mino streaking up the boards, finds his man, and that's going to be one nothing for the Bears. Waldo puts that through for his third goal of the season. Hershey going up early. Beautiful pass here from Mino, streaking right in between the D-man. He's just not close enough to Waldo, and Waldo puts that in. Going to find the back of the net. Already a timeout here for Henderson. Hopefully on the, the chat there, you can hear me too. Just let me know. Sometimes I select the uh, wrong shit. So I see Muzz in there too. So shout out to you guys. So guard. Early time out here by the Silver Knights. Not sure if uh, maybe the goalie had tether on or just, uh, just a quick little chat in the locker room. Rocket stalling there. Finds his man. Ollie to Voxity. Up the board, Serpentine route down low, but Waldo, nice to intercept that. Haller with almost a nice pass, a saucer up there to Fist, and Mino getting harassed behind the board. Fist still takes it, but Tom Tom's going to take it away, and Henderson's going the other way. Great pass with Demers, also draws a penalty, and that's going to be one to one. 
Henderson evening up. That's going to cancel that penalty, but ties this game up with still a lot of time in this game in the first. That's the left wing Demers for his third of the season. Straight back from Waldo to Smoke. This gets it taken away. Tom Tom settles it down. Rocket up the boards to Demers. Back to the point. Fist intercepts that. Has a streak in Mino. Waldo to Mino. Nice pass over to Waldo. Returning the favor. And that's Hershey going up 2-1 to one, just like that. Already a lot of goals scored in this first period. That's going to be Mino's, I think, second goal of the season. Or rather, uh, Waldo's fourth goal of the season. Yeah, I think the first one, actually. I think that's Waldo's second tonight. I might be already off here, but... Good dump in here by Smoke. Evoxity. Back to Ollie. Demers on the boards. Finds a little space. Cross crease. Back to Demers. And that's a nice block there. Aldo slows it down. Finds Howler. Smoke trying to get that deep. Hits his man Mina. And Rocket's going to slip. Uh, rather scoop that up. Demers no straight line chance there. Howler takes that away. Smoke up to Waldo, finds the 45-degree cut Mino, and gets hit there at the line. Rocket looking the other way, and Tom Tom's going to go off sides here. 2-1 to one with uh, just halfway through this first period. Already a lot of action. If you're just joining us, this is uh, AHL LG, Hershey Bears versus the Silver Knights. Hershey up 2-1. to one. Tom Tom finds the center. Good hold, but Cartier stonewalls that. He glove saves that and he's going to hold it. Face off in Hershey's zone. Waldo's been good on the dot tonight. Straight back by Henderson. Silver Knight, or rather, this. Yeah, Silver Knights there. Tom Tom Wiggles at the blue line. And the Soda Knights get it stripped. Waldo searching for it. Does reach the puck in time, but doesn't have anybody to send it to. And Silver Knights going the other way. Good takeaway from Howler. Mino breaks his man, gets it down low. Almost finds a streaking fist on that rebound. Tom Tom back the other way. Gets it down low. Doesn't go for icing. Waldo... Streaking has space. Good interception by Ollie. Right back the other way. Waldo takes it off and picks it up off of that hit. Behind Gretzky's office. Finds Fist. Fist with a nice shot. Trying to surprise Jay Philly, but he's going to cover that one up. Good pressure by the Hershey Bear so far. Jay Philly back there rocking an 822 save percentage. He's already played six games for them, so it looks like their main primary goaltender. Mino behind the net. Finds the point. There's a shot from Smoke. Tom Tom streaking down the boards. Has nobody, though. Good poke by Howler. Does pick it up. Looks for the center. Can't get the, the force there. Smokes in the center to block that, and a great shot by Mino, but it's going to go right into the red basket of Philly. Carter on the opposite end, rocking an 882 save percentage at 180 goals against. He's also rocked six games last week, too. Rocket with a questionable uh, Omaha there. And Howler has space. It's a taken away by uh, Rocket. Demers. Nice save by Cartier. Gets up for the rebound and saves that one. Holding that 2-1 league as Hers Hershey goes into the uh, locker room. 
at the end of the uh, end of the first, lucky to go up two to one. So you see Waldo on that replay putting in goal number two, I believe, and they're probably feeling pretty good. They had a little bit of struggles last week with a one and two start, but this line's been playing together and they look strong tonight. Go to the intermission screen here so you can get a look at the lineups just in case if you didn't uh, come in at the start here. Bears with Cartier back in net. Jay Philly on the other side for the Silver Knights. You can see at center for the Hershey Bears, you got Waldo. Centered uh, in between Mino on the left. Right is Fist. Left D is Smoke and right D is Howler. We're going to get back to game action. We'll check out the Silver Knights in the uh, end of the second there. Straight back by the Silver Knights. Good job by Tom Tom. Evoxity gets it to Tom Tom, but Tom Tom gets that stripped away. It's too much traffic in front of the net. Smoke finds Mino. Mino with a good wrap around there to Fist, who's behind the net. Works his way at the point and almost a tip in front. Good shot by Howler and almost a wrap around chance by Fist. Silver Knights really like that play. With the slap shot Omaha on the the board entries there. Looking for that tip in front. Good save by Cartier. And a good pickup there by Smoke to get that out too. Ollie takes it up from the defensive side. Looking for his center. He's still behind the net. And they're going to throw that out of the zone. They're going to have to reset. Yeah, Lou. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll try and play and I do this at the same time. Yeah. Let's see how that goes. <laughs> Cartier looking comfortable back there. Tie up by Waldo. Fortunately goes to the other team. Good play by Fist. Finds a streak in Mino. 45 degree. Goes one-on-one -on -one with a goalie. And a good save by Philly. Good chance from the Bears, though. Still have the pressure in the zone with a shot from the point. Philly's going to have to cover that up. Already three-fourths of the way on that pressure system there. Both goalies already 800 save percentages tonight so far. Holding their own. It's a close game, 2-1 to one here, almost halfway through the second. Aller at the point, wiggling, finds the man down low, is Fist. Fist finds his guy in front, is Mino. Good save by Philly. Tom Tom as in and finds Demers with a nice shot, but great save by Cartier. Fast break here for the Bears. Waldo at the blue line. Good pickup by Howler, but they're going to lose it. Evoxity takes it the other way on the opposite wing. And Waldo's going to slow this up a little bit. Good entry here. I like that little slap shot entry play. And a great find as Waldo takes a slapper from the point. Another shot. Hershey firing on all cylinders right now. Another shot, unfortunately, on the backhand. Tom Tom's going to get held up at the line. He's going off sides. Two to one for the Hershey Bears playing the Silver Knights here in white on your top. Hershey obviously in brown. Other tie up. This time the Knights come out with it. They find the point. Rocket gets stripped and Mino's there. Streaking towards the net. Has Waldo. Just can't get it over the stick of the defender, and that's going to go out of play. Face off in the Silver Knight zone. Oh, and that's a penalty there. So, power play for the Bears. 
I didn't even see it there. So two minute here for the Hershey Bears as they look to go up three to one on this power play. Almost halfway through it. To find the point. Howler finds his man Mina, but that's going to get blocked by the right wing exo uh, exhausts. Exhausted. <laughs> Evoxity, sorry. Good shot by Smoke. And Howler just fumbles that off the skate. Unlucky not getting the pickup there. Voxity gets it stripped. And Hershey Bears going the other way. Good play by Ollie back there on the D zone as the Knights clear that. And they're going to clear that uh, power play there too. So. Even numbers back here for Hershey. And that force it almost finds its way through. Scary situation for Hershey, but they get out of it. Nice slap around by Smoke. Fist to Waldo. Circling behind the net like a shark. And Tom Tom's going to find his way free. Good play by Smoke, though, to not let the breaking winger go. You know, looking for his right winger fist, just can't get the pass off. And a good hit by Mino in the, the neutral zone there. And there there's goes Hershey there. Good hit by Fist. They keep it in the zone. Five seconds left. Shot from the point gets blocked. And Hershey, uh, rather, the Silver Nets are going to clear that. And no goals that period after we saw three in the first period. So teams are kind of. Getting a little adjusted to each other now. Two to one though is Hershey as they're going into the locker room again for the end of the second. We'll go back over to the intermission screen. We'll take a look at uh, the Henderson side of the lineup there. So we already said Jay Phillies and net. He's been pretty rock solid there. Already seen 15 shots. You can see faceoffs are pretty even there um, on the screen. I know you can't see it right now, but just giving you some details. Everything else looks pretty even. Uh, Silver Knights only with six shots, though. Demers on the left wing for the Silver Knights. Like I said, they got a mix and match of lines from uh, last week, so they did not for running the same line, maybe for availability. But Tom Tom in the middle, Evoxity uh, on the right, Ollie on right D, Rocket on left D, Jay Phil and Net. We're gonna start the third here too, so we'll go back for you. Waldo with the tie up. Knights come out with it. Demers streaks. Still has the puck. Finds Ollie at the blue line, and that gets blocked. Ollie behind his net to Rocket. Tom Tom breaks the blue line, but Waldo, nice interception, but somehow that goes back and another good poke though by, by Smoke to mitigate any damage there. Another cross. Good layers by Hershey. Smoke almost finds his man. He did that slap pass there. Wiggle. By fist and a shot gets blocked. Waldo almost with a good cha uh, chance there. Good forecheck. Just misses his streak in Mino. Good play by Ollie in the back end there for the, the Knights. Still a close game here. Two to one for the Hershey Bears if you're just joining us. No straight line access there. Both men uh, on the D zone are going to pinch that off. And good interception by Waldo. Tom Tom has a chance. Two on two here. Tries forcing, but good layers again by Hershey. Another shot attempt, and Cartier's going to gobble that up. Let's slow things down here for Hershey. Get a little breather. Big face off. Waldo wins that straight back. Ooh, risky pass, but works out. Hershey's on the break, finds Mino with a wrap around the boards. Waldo behind the net. Back to the point. Good 
Mist and Waldo trying to get something done down low, but Silver Knights come up with it. And great poke by Howler. Stops anyone when it's on there, and Fist has a little room, but losing the momentum. And a nice pass by Waldo! Waldo to Fist! And Fist's gonna come up with his sixth goal of the season. Great pass by Waldo, and a very good four check from him, too. And that's gonna be Hershey going up three to one with probably halfway through this third period now. Sogard in the chat is saying that is the best stick lift he's ever seen. It was pretty sweet, and Hershey's going to enjoy that going up with uh, two goals left in the third. Good play by Smoke. They did clear the blue, but back in their zone. Nice slap around by Smoke again. Finds Fisk over to Waldo in the center. Slap on shot. And that's going to be gobbled up by Jay Philly. They got a hill, hill to climb here with about seven minutes left in the third. Face off win by Waldo. Fisk gets that shot blocked on net. Another face off in the Silver Knights zone. Tie up. Silver Knights come up with it, but Fisk gets that on the forecheck and taking it right back. Demers on the left boards. It's a stripped, and Fist is running, streaking, finds Howler, who's up in the rush, and just right into Philly's pads there. Unlucky. Six minutes left in the third. Straight back from Waldo. Nice tip in front. Off the shot of uh, Smoke there. A little confusion in the zone there by the Silver Knights, and Hershey Bears are going to clear that. Demers enters cleanly. Back to his point. Rocket has nobody there and gets it stripped away. His forward line is doing a good job at back checking as well for the Hershey Bears. Great forecheck there in the neutral zone. Mino tries to find that short side. Demers off the boards. Back to Demers from the point. Good save. Cartier travel, uh, traveling not too far to grab that one. He's already in position. Clock is working against the Silver Knights here. Almost two minutes left in the third. Hershey still up three to one. Looking to start their night off right with a win. Good slap around by Howler. And Mino's going to get hit. It's a chance here for the Silver Knights. Good save by Cartier. Doesn't budge at all on that short side attempt from Tom Tom. Big draw here in Hershey's zone. Waldo collected, gets that straight back. Say so Hershey works it out of their zone, gets it taken away in the neutral zone. Evoxity on the right boards, wiggling, finds little room and finds the point. Rocket with a backhander. Definitely didn't mean to do that, I'm sure. And Hershey's going the other way. Gets it down low, and they're going to probably cap this game up. Only 15 seconds left. Shot from the point. Carter is going to pad his stats a little bit with that save. 7.6 left as Silver Knights are going to be going a man up as they pull the goalie. Another good win by Waldo. Smoke can't get it out, but there's not enough time to do damage. Hershey Bears are going to win this one. They're going to win their first for the night, good way to start it as they go up 6-3 and 1 for the season. Good games by both the forward line and defensive line and just all around good game by the Hershey Bears. Cartier making some good saves back there too.
We're going to play a little bit of a uh, Be Right Back session as we wait for game two to come on. Uh, I'm just going to grab a drink and I'll be back. So. get the uh, lineup sheet up here for you as the Hershey Bears are searching. Um, they're going to be playing the Firebirds. Let me see if I can get the uh, graphic change for you. Firebirds coming uh, off of an 0-4 loss. Uh, I forgot who they played, but they're 3-7 uh, and seven on the season, as you just saw Hershey winning their first game against the Henderson Silver Knights to go up uh, five, or rather 6-3-1 and one for the season. So always good to start off on a win. Familiar face back in net there for the Firebirds as you see Terry O on your screen, the streamer. Good dude. Looking to see if they can fight against the Hershey Bears, but you got the same lineup for Hershey. 
So no real changes there, obviously, no surprises. Uh, Levechkin on your left wing for the Firebirds. And Pepsi on the right wing. Chico in center. Cray on left D, Buckeye on right D. I haven't seen them play before, but either way, like Lou said, you can't, uh, can't play down to the level. you got to play, play your game. So Hershey looking to go for their second win of the night. Waldo, I think, coming off of uh, two goals in the last game. And Fist, I think, put in, uh, adding another one for his sixth goal of the season. Waldo at four at that total. Mino, the assist maker there on that line tonight. Carter, your stats improving there, too. With that 3-1 to one victory, uh, 884 save percentage, which is phenomenal, and a 1.67 goals against average, speaking to the team's def uh, team defense there. We got the search coming. Looks like we're going to get this one started, so we can move over. I don't know many of these players on the Firebird side. I think I've played with Levechkin before and then Terrio, obviously. See what they bring tonight, though. Not a, uh, not an optimal smart start for the Firebirds, three and seven, but still can't be taken lightly. You're gonna see the Bears rocking their chocolate brown jerseys again. And Firebirds are gonna be in white. They'll be on your top screen with Hershey on your bottom. <laughs> hopefully, yeah, sweet, sweetly, hopefully, man. I'm ready though. I want to play tonight, so. Love those Hershey uh, ads there from Cartier. Those look nice. Ignore the betting system in the uh, chat there. I didn't set it up yet, so. Mino getting the shot. First shot of the game getting blocked. Firebirds almost putting that between Terry O. He's going to cover that though. All the money on Hershey from Muzz. Chico at the center gets hit. Good layers by Hershey again. And unlucky Fist just can't get that on the opposite side of Cray. But good pick off by Waldo. Great two-way play from him tonight. Good hit by Fist. And Firebird somehow slinking that out. And a good keep by Smoke. But Cray's there to gobble that up from the Firebirds. And finds Levechkin on the left wing boards. Cray gets it down low but doesn't have anybody. Hershey's going the other way. Finds Waldo streaking Mino. To Fist. Fist doesn't have anybody center. Still working at it, though, behind the net. Good pressure without taking a penalty there. Good hit by Smoke. Finds his man Howler. Waldo takes it up the boards. Fist down low in Gretzky's office. Gets it to the point. Howler back down low to Fist. And a shot. For, and that's going to go in. Smoke. <laughs> Smoke's going to get his first goal of the season. As he zombie walks to a 1-0 Hershey Bears lead. Finds that just under the pads of Terry O. What a way to start. 1-0 here for Hershey. Pepsi looking to even the score. Shot from the point gets blocked from layers. And a great save by Cartier. Not moving short side for that. Good 
good push up by Smoke. This to Mino. Mino with a quick shot from the point. Finds the blue line. Smoke looking for another. All those streaks and Mino is going to find Mino in the slot for a one touch push in. Or rather, a one time push in. And that's 2 0 for Hershey. Mino finding his second goal of the season. Finally being on the other end of that assist and getting on the scoreboard. Howler keeps at the blue line, gets it poked. Smoke finds it, goes the other way. Good slap pass up the boards, finds Fist. Down low to Mino. Can't cut it towards the middle, but Fist picks it up. Finds Howler at the point. Good shot. Really throw him down opposite side on Terrio. Good pressure by Hershey. Not playing down to the Firebirds level at all. Shout out to Flo in the chat. Player of the week, Flo. Waldo, good pick off. Fist has a lot of space, finds Mino down back low to who Fist was looking for a wraparound. Just bounces off the uh, the wood there and Terry's gonna clean that up. Two nothing here for the Bears as we close towards the end of the first. Looking for that attack at the point again that's wide open still. You know, using some uh, some uh, button mapping there for the passing. Oh, almost a force by the Firebirds. And that's going to go for icing, looking for that Omaha chance to fist. Big face off here. Waldo's been great on the dot tonight. Hershey Bear is a little low on energy from fist. Waldo does win that, but Firebirds do somehow find the puck and a good block, and somehow that gets into Cartier's bread basket. Good save. I lost that one for a second. Straight back by the Firebirds. Good job by Chico. Buckeye gets it down low. Chico tries to find his man cutting to the net. A good interception by Smoke. Fist behind the net. Finds Howler. Back to Fist. Shoots it short side. Good save by Terry, though. And Streaky Pepsi has room. One-on-one -on -one and a good poke. And another good layers for Hershey. They sweat a little bit there. Keep the game 2 nothing, But a good chance by the Firebirds. He's the streaking. I think that was Pepsi who found that. Little crack in the defense there. A great save by Cartier. And one minute left in this first period. Good action here towards the end of it. 2 nothing for Hershey, though. Hershey's lucky to be up still 2 nothing. Firebirds with some good chances. But nice settle down. Little breather. Hope to keep that 2 nothing going into the end of the first. A push by Chico, and Levechkin gets that shot saved by Cartier. Another good save. Sporting the 40 Tuka Rask number back there. Straight back by the Firebirds. Chico wins that. He's down low, finds the streaking Levechkin, who can't get the shot off. Gonna be another icing. Some time here with the Firebirds at the end of the first with two and a half seconds left. See what they can do on the draw. These are big momentum killers here. Big face off win for Waldo is needed. Do it at straight back, but that goes out of the zone. So two nothing for Hershey going into the locker room at the end of the first. Good start.
as they look for their second uh, win of the night. We'll uh, lock it up to the intermission screen for a little bit. We'll check out the face-off stats and stuff, though. Didn't really do that last game, so. We'll do that, because uh, we already saw the uh, the lineups in the beginning, so let's take a look at the stats. No sideline reporter tonight, so it's doing everything by myself. Shots in advantage for Hershey. Face-off's pretty even. A little bit on the uh, Firebird side. No penalties by either team. Passing's pretty even. Time on attack, yeah, somewhat even. But solid game so far. Two great goals by Hershey. Uh, I think both were actually, yeah, right in the... One was in the point, and then a nice shot by Smoke from the blue line. We're going to start the second period. Good win by Waldo. Fist on his opposite boards. Finds Mina. Gets it taken away. Here comes the Firebirds. Pepsi on the boards. Doesn't have anybody really. Trying to serpentine route. Smoke down low already. They do pick it up though. Levechkin and they're going to have to clear the zone. Good forecheck by the bear. Says Fist is chasing him out of his own zone there. Like a bear. A grizzly bear. Good shot by Howler. Good save by Terry, though. Two on two. And misplaced pass by the Firebirds. And Hershey just a little off sides there. 16 left in the second. If anybody's just joining us, this is uh, LG AG, uh, rather AHL. Hershey Bears versus the Coachella Valley Firebirds. Firebirds three and seven on the season. Hershey Bears six three and one after their last game, winning against the Henderson Silver Knights. Firebirds line has struggled so far last week, uh, running the same line as last week. They were zero and three, so far zero and one for tonight. Ovechkin finds his man Cray. Down low, finds his opposite, Buckeye, right defenseman, gets hit by Mino, and there's Fist with room. Gets it stripped away by Levechkin, still pucks the puck up though, and again another strip by Levechkin. He's got the puck up to Pepsi. Pepsi just really looking for an outlet there. There's Buckeye, takes the net, finds his man, but good poke. I think by Waldo there. Etchkin with a save and what a save by Cardi here. <laughs> Off that rebound attempt. Unbelievable. What a save as he snowmans on that thing. And the Bears are obviously happy with that one. Loving the way that Cartier is playing tonight. Good shot on net by Mino. Can't find the redirection for Fist on that rebound. But good pressure nonetheless. Good forecheck too by Fist. Finds Waldo. Back to Fist. They try to work it down low. Waldo in Gretzky's office. Back to Fist. Still maining possession here. Need a possession clock here in the zone. Howler picks it up. Goes down low. Finds Mino. Back to the point. Smoke shot on net. Tip goes wide by Fist. Another down low. They're working it. The shot from the point just goes a little wide by Waldo. Howler up to Fist, who's been working the puck quite well from Waldo. Can't find a streaking fist on that. Chico spreads the middle. They both get a poke on that, I think. Both Howler and Smoke. Good shot on net. Levechkin 
Little LT action. Still has the puck, but goes right into four bears there. This lack of energy just gets on net. Smart choice. Get to regain some of that stamina. You see him trailing back. Chico into the zone at C, and there's nobody around the boards again. Nice chop from Smoke and a big hit. As Fisk goes down to the ice, he's back up. Good layers in the neutral zone from Hershey Bears. Flow, or rather, uh, Smoke up to Haller. And that's a tripping call there as Mino almost finds the backhander behind Terrio. Chico going to the sin bin for two. Big power play for Hershey. Looking to go up 3-0 at the end of the second. Pretty much going to take the uh, completion of this power play going into the, uh, the locker room here. Bucky on the PK. Finds Levechkin from the point, but Cartier is there. Right into the glove. Drying a little time off that clock, though, but faceoff's going to be in the Hershey Bear zone. Tie up. Howler picks it up. Smoke back to Howler. Finds Waldo streaking, but good take by Cray, who gets it blocked on that slap out. Just getting harassed, but does still manage to get the, to the point. Smoke with a nice pass to Mino. And that cross crease force gets intercepted by Firebirds as they get a clear on the PK. About 30 seconds left for Hershey Bears. Fist looks to attack. It's a stride deke there. It gets taken away by Levechkin. You know, back to Howler at the point. Five seconds left. Good shot. But great save by Terry O as he covers that up with five seconds left in the period. Nice face off chance here for Hershey Bears, though. Looking for a little whipped cream as they go into the third period for intermission soon. Another shot on net for Hershey, not gonna challenge Terry. This game's still close, two nothing. As uh, back to back games where we saw all the goals in the first and none in the second period but I'm sure we're going to see some in the third for sure. A lot of pressure coming out by uh, Hershey there. Going to love these slow-mo uh, replays. Take forever. Great save by Cartier there. As you can see, that replay going into the intermission. He's been solid as all save shots faced against him with the save. That big one right there that you see on your screen with the snowman save at the end. Ridiculous. You can see the shots in favor of Hershey now as they had that power play as well, doing a lot of damage. Passing still pretty similar. Time on attack close enough. Firebirds getting shut out their first game as well, looking to get on the board. Straight back by Waldo, finds Smoke up to Mino. Nice shot, just getting pucks on net and collapsing. I'm liking this neutral zone trap they play. Levechkin, tricky pass there. Somehow got through, but Waldo intercepts that afterwards. Mino with a shot on net. Terry O's there. He's in position. No rebound offered there for the streaking fist. Face off in Coachella zone. Chico's been good on the dot. Waldo's going to take that one, though. And a good shot by Howler from the point. Waldo can't follow it up. Finds Mino with a stick lift by Buckeye. Pressure here by Hershey Bears is un just unwilling right now. Howler up to Mino. Mino with a slap shot. No rebound there again. Terrio's going to 
cover that up. Tie up from Waldo. Mino can't find anything short side. As Buckeyes on his back. Veshkin up the boards. Nice back pass. Back to the point by Chico and finds Pepsi in the middle, but Cartier is tracking that easily. Not going to challenge him much without that extra pass there. Tie up. Pepsi comes up with it. Nothing, not going short side. Cartier holding his short well. Keeping that lead 2 nothing for the Bears. Doesn't want to give this team, the Firebirds, any momentum. Shot from the point. Good block by Howler. Behind the net. And they're going to find Levechkin from Chico. Little behind the net play. And finds Chico for, or rather finds uh, Levechkin for the 2-1. to one. Levechkin's second goal of the season. Hershey looking to get back in the goal column again as they uh, just saw Coachella split their lead in half. Still up 2-1 to one though with only about 13 left in this third period. Looking for their second win of the night. Firebirds just happy to get on the board I'm sure after a 0-4 loss in their first game. They got a little momentum. Lovechkin kind of twirling around there. Serpentine route. Down low, but Howler's there. Good read. He finds Fist. Howler's streaking down the boards. A little stop and go and finds Mino. They're just unfortunate bounce off the boards at the back uh, backside. Goes to Buckeye. Good poke by Hershey to get that out. Wasn't sure which one of them, but he had three different guys poking at that one. They're good layers. Good pass by Fist. Mino has room. Good shot on net. Oh, and a great save by Terry O. Off of that rebound chance, Fisk can't find the back of the net. I'm sure his mouth was a little bit open on that one. That's a good save by Terry. Keeps it 2-1 to one for Coachella. Ray back up to Levechkin as they switch spots from Dita. Left wing and a good pass. Good shot, but even better save by Cartier. A little pressure here from them. Howler picks it up, gets it up to Waldo quick, and they're on the break. Looking for blood. So Waldo gets it down low to Mino. Mino with a wrap, and Terry's just there in time. Vechkin has Chico, who's going to peel off. Pressure on Howler as he's getting... Squished in between two guys there. Excuse me. A couple good saves by by Cartier. Four minutes left in this period. It's a great interception by Smoke. Fist down low to Mino. Gonna bleed some of this time down. Looking for short side, but Chico's there in the back check. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Skull. I see too, man. Gray up to Lovechkin, up the left wing behind the net. Can't find anybody center, and Smoke's going to slow that down just a little bit. Smart play. Finds Howler. It's an unfortunate turnover. Lovechkin throws it right back into Howler. Howler, another interception. Hershey lucky to get that out. 30 seconds left. Mino back to his man, Fist, and he's going to put this game away more than likely as they're up 3-1. to one. Big goal with 30 seconds left in the third period. Bears eyeing their second win of the night. And Fist is going to find a little honey there. That's his seventh goal of the season. Great block by Smoke. 20 seconds left as the Firebirds surge. And Howler's going to come out on the other end of that one. He's taking it. Probably going to go down low. As he bleeds this clock. Buckeyes just come out. 
about 10 seconds, and there's a good slap pass down. Doesn't end up on the right side of the boards, though. Levechkin getting stripped, harassed, and fist. They're going to end this. That's game for Hershey Bears as they get, take their second game of the night. The Bears improving to 7 3 and 1. Sure, it feels good to win those first two. They're going to have a pretty fine challenge, though, as they face off against the Condors in the third game of their night. Firebirds going down to now 3-8 and eight for the season. As that line struggling there more, going 0-5 in their first two weeks so far. I'm going to bring it over to the intermission screen. We'll get the uh, lineup up there, and I'll probably take a little break as a... Uh... We, uh, wait for the search. Yeah, if you're just joining us, we're following the AHL. Hershey Bears tonight already winning their first two. Definitely the game of the night will be this last game against the Condors of uh, Bakersfield. We'll get this up for you here. Let me get some music for you. I'll be back.
waiting on the Condors. I think that are still wrapping up their game against the Cleveland. Uh, is it Cleveland? I can't remember. Something monsters. I think it's Cleveland, but don't have an update on the score yet for you. But Hershey coming off of two great wins tonight. First off against the uh, Henderson Silver Knights and followed up against the Coachella Valley Firebirds. They're uh, looking pretty good right now. 7-3-1 and one for the season. A nice change for them after they started a little slow last week as uh, going 1-2. and two, Already 2-0 two and oh for the night. Looking to cap off a three-night uh, victory there. Both... Uh, Boards and D men just uh, looking pretty solid in each part of the zone. Good back checking, good, good board checking. Great saves by Carter. You saw one of the. Uh, hopefully, we'll get a clip of that later. I'll try to clip it for him too. But unbelievable save there against the Coachella Valley Firebirds as he uh, made an incredible save off of a rebound, snowmanning at the end there too. His save percentage is going to go go up there a little bit after that game too, as he goes to 889. 1.57 goals against average, which is a testament there to the team there as a team defense stat. So all around good play by the Hershey Bears as they uh, look to continue that tonight, playing very confident. A lot of good, uh, uh, I didn't watch their games last night, but a lot of good uh, slap wraps there that they're doing. Uh, not really taking a lot of time with the puck, just getting shit on net. Causing havoc in the uh, offensive zone with their four checking and playing that neutral zone trap that seems to be working for them. So, not opting for the typical blue line trap uh, and trying to really steal and siphon the speed of the other team as they play a little four check action into that neutral zone trap, which is very much working for them. <laughs> little shout out to. Uh, Smoke getting his first goal of the season. A nice little shot from the point. Finds its way past uh, the sliding Terrio, who we all love to. Shout out to Terrio if he's on. Hopefully get this thing going started in a little bit. Let me check my chats and see what's going on the other end. Crofto, thanks for the follow, man. Fellow Hershey Bear, salute to you. Still no update on the Condors game, so I know they started a little bit late, so. I'm in a chat with some of them too, I don't see any update. I see uh, a controller gif with somebody throwing a TV, so that might be that, might mean that the Condors won that game, but we'll see. Regardless, anybody's in the chat there. Thanks for joining us as we're following the Hershey Bears AHL LG tonight. As we said earlier, winning their first two games of the night, correcting their last week, and seems like they picked up as far as their their chemistry goes. Definitely playing outside a league as well as you can see. It's going to be a good one against the Condors. I think they lost their first game in OT, I want to say. And seem to be, I don't know if they're struggling again tonight against the uh, um, uh, the Cleveland. Uh, what the hell is just on my mind? But, but Swamp something, I don't even remember. I've been drinking, so. Oh, the con yeah, they're fucking playing the... Uh, fuck is it yeah the swamp monsters is it yeah so cleveland monsters my bad i don't know all the ahl teams yet so i guess we'll take a look at the lineups while we try to kill a little bit of time here so no changes obviously for the bears side as you see in them all one two uh first two games there so we'll rattle off there but mino coming in scoring two goals tonight Waldo, a couple goals himself tonight. Total for four. Just with, uh, I think he had 
two as well, but he's at seven total. A lot of scoring from just majority of that line, so they're sharing. And as we said, Smoke had one earlier as well. Howler looking for his first goal of the season. Maybe he'll get that in uh, tonight's game against the Condors. Bakersfield pretty solid on their line, uh, at least on paper. Maybe not so tonight. We'll see how they come out of the Monsters game. But Sibas or Sibas, I don't know how you pronounce it, is their, their center. Pretty well known, followed with a the centering of left wing Lukes. And right wing is going to be fat load tonight. PD on the left side defensively with Spaceless at right D. He already has eight assists and a goal on the season. And uh, in between the pipes is Stricky, six game played or rather, excuse me, it'll be his eighth coming into this game, but seems to be their leading goaltender with uh, 1.12 goals against average before the start of tonight and a save percentage of 891, but that definitely went down since the last uh, loss in overtime they just had. But coming into this night, this was definitely the watch uh, for the Hershey Bears was of uh, Bakersfield Condors. So looks like we're going to get started here in just a second. Let me see what the other outcome was for the other game. Looks like Bakersfield did pull out the win, though. So they're going to go up to 6-2-3 and three for the season. So strap down, though. Pop some corn. This one's going to be a pretty good one. This is definitely the game of the night, the one that you want to stick around and see. Luke's on the left wing with five goals, four from the center, eight goals for fat load on the season already. Yeah, we'll update some stats here. Strictly or Stricky rather, looking at an 874 save percentage with a 148 goals against, which another again is just a team stat, but that's solid. All right, so we're going to move into the play-by-play -play and get this one going. You're still with us tonight. Thanks for uh, being in the stream. This is going to be the last game of the night. Hershey Bears coming in at 7-3-1, take on the Bakersfield Condors 6-2-3. Their line for the Condors going 3-0 last week. Sporting a plus 9, plus 5 on the other side for the Bears. Bears still rocking those beautiful brown jerseys. Bakersfield with the orange, blue, and white cream color. As you see them on the top of the screen, grabbing that puck is spaceless. Finds his man, Sebus, who... Enters the zone, short side, and getting Cartier to slide towards that. Didn't find a connection. Waldo finds a little space. He's going to take it himself and gets that slap around. Lukes is there already, though. That load's going to go off sides. The CBS is just a little too anxious there. Back pass, getting Cartier involved. Nice little stream pass to Fist. <laughs> looking for an assist there is Cartier. Looking to get on the sheet. Mino with a short side, almost off the pads there in front for, for Waldo. Other slap pass going around the boards. And that's going for icing as he just hit that just before the red line. Big face off. Good push up by Waldo as Howler brings that up to Smoke. Smoke finds his streaking man fist, gets hit immediately, but Waldo picks it up and a good save by Stricky. So he's going to cover that up with 14 minutes left in the first period. And if you're just joining us, this is AHL action, league gaming. Hershey Bears on the bottom, Bakersfield Condor is on your top screen. Tie-up goes the other way for the Condors. 
And good back check here by the forward line for Hershey Bears. Chris slows up just a little bit, change of direction. Still has the puck. Tries to get a shot near side and finds Mino on the back side and finds Wallow up in front. Nice shot from the point, but great save by Stricky. They still have possession here, working that pressure. Short side attempt by Fisk gets blocked. And Condors go the other way with 45 cut. And a, wow. Weird pass on net. Cartier in position though. Seabass working in it back and forth. Getting harassed by Fisk. Good poke by Mino as Fisk streaks to the net. Has some room. Mino on the other side and a great save by Stricky though. Great action already so far as we go halfway through the first now. Seabass wiggling, finds it on net, but good save by Cartier. Condors have it down low. Good up by Smoke, though. You know, holds it and finds Fist. Howler at the zone, gets a backhand attempt by a mistake. It's an unfortunate. Uh, Luke's going the other way. Off of Seabass, and Fist is going to pick that up. Has Smoke and gets hit immediately. Ponders gobble that up, and they're on the uh, breakout here. Good layers, though, in front by Waldo. Ponders enter the zone. Little hit by Mino. Fat load. Works it back to Spaceless at the point. Little LT drag down low. They tried to find the middle, and Fizz is missing the uh, slap attempt. Luckily... The Condors didn't find that. Waldo, nice little serpentine route. Finds Mino. Unfortunately, a backhand attempt. Has it. Goes short side over. Nice pass to Fist. Just could not get the shot off. And what an attempt by Hershey. Ooh, Condor is lucky to not go down 1-0 on that one. Smoke holding it on his backhand. Finds Fist. Nice play. Down low back to Mino. And work it again down low. Does... Uh, PD's going to find that, though, and he's going. It's four on two here for the Condors. Fake slap shot, tries to force that, and that's going to get taken away. Waldo going the other way. So that's going to go for icing, though. Just a little miss on that self or the uh, manual sauce there. These games have been... Pretty good. I've been on the edge of my sheet. Yeah, my sheet, my uh, my seat here. I'm trying to lay back for posture. It's my back's hurting a little bit, but it's too much action going on. Face off in the neutral zone. Although with a push. Honduras find it though. Luke's the left wing finds a little room. Gets a shot on net. Cartier is there to save that short side. Already going to be through this period, and that's zero to zero. First time we didn't see Hershey on the board in the first period. Hershey looking for a three and zero night. <laughs> Yeah, it's too exciting, man. I can't get close enough to this screen. Hershey uh, advantage on the shot department. Good passing and time on attack pretty much even on both sides. Faceoffs split down the middle, three and three for both Cebus and uh, and uh, Waldo there. One team looking to. Break the scoreless sheet right now. It's been good hockey so far that first 20, though. Ponders are 1 0 and 1 on the night. Hershey 2 0 so far. Let's see if this one's that straight back. Good pass to Luke's on the boards. Finds a little room to shoot that short side, but Carter is not, not going to challenge him at all. Good interception by Smoke. Gets it all the way down. Wraps it to Fist. He does pick that up. Gets it down low to Mino. Back over to Howler. Howler takes a shot from the point. Gets blocked. As Sebus is in front of Waldo. Waldo 
Trying to get back as Seabass goes straight down and shoots it short side off the iron. A little pressure here from the Condors. Behind the net, can't find a streaking man. Good hit by Mino. That was a big one. Hershey going the other way. Finds Mino. Almost finds Waldo back door. Just a big poke check by Mac or Petey. And they're going to go off sides. It's probably a good break for Hershey there. This card here. <laughs> Carter out at the net. Straight back here by Waldo. As he makes Seba's jump there. Great hit by Smoke on fat load. Doesn't let that straight line up. Waldo taking it. Gets a clapper down low. And Condor is onto it now. They've been actually doing a pretty good job at mitigating that. Great save by Cartier on that. Chance by Seabus. If I'm mispronouncing his name too, just let me know. I don't know how to fucking say it. So. Tie up. Or she comes out with it though. This gets hit, but Howler's there to support his man. Finds Waldo. You know, with the 45, and somehow that sneaks out of the blue, and that's going to go off sides. Seabass? Okay, thank you. Okay. I didn't know if he was French or something. I'm just <laughs> spelling shit wrong. I don't know. <laughs> Tie up. Luke's is going to find it, though. Has to find some room. Does get it down low. Condors with a poke from the point. Seabass behind the net. Cartier's going to cover that one up. 19 here. Okay. Yeah, actually, uh, non-disclosure, I had a uh, interaction with him tonight <laughs> earlier. I, I figured he was probably younger. Good dump and almost finds Mino, who just can't connect. Or does connect, but great block by the Condors. Seabass, Serpentine, finds space, but gets hit. As that space closes up pretty quickly. And Mino finds a shot on net that does pop out, but Fish just can't get there in time. We're going to have the ice crew clean that helmet off the ice. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We're still scoreless. Yoshi's won it off the face off. Face off win for the Condors. They got a three on two chance here. PD defenseman over to flat load. Good save. Carter not moving an inch. Fist, quick play up to Howler. Tries the end of the zone. Does get it deep down. Finds Mino on the other side. Smoke with a good shot on net. Fist does find it. And has Waldo back over to Mino behind the net. Back to Waldo. Good to hold there. Not forcing anything. Good job. With a good attempt there in the middle. Hershey really getting some pressure on. But opposite way here comes the Condors. Three on three. From the point, Spaceless gets it blocked. Still picks it up, though, and what a save by Cartier. He's been making some great saves back there tonight. Mino almost with a uh, manual sauce over to Fist. Good try. And that's going to go icing. Three minutes left in the second period, and for a 0 0 game, this has been pretty damn entertaining. Mino pops up with that out of the faceoff win. Maddie, thanks for the follow, man. Another Hershey Bear. I look forward to seeing you on Tuesday. 
Petey from the point back over to Lukes on the wing and a good save by Cartier again. Howler getting a little harassment back there and the Condors do still maintain puck possession. Spats with a spinorama, but great save by Cartier just following that. And a fast break here. He's got Fisk going and a good interception by Petey. And they're going to take, uh, what is that, a slashing call maybe. A tripping call. That's Mino going to the box. And Hershey's going to finish up this period on the PK. There's eight seconds left. Big draw, though. Want to keep this 0-0 going in. Good win by Waldo. That does just go off of the skate of the defenseman out of the zone. One last chance here. A good block, good layers by Hershey Bears. 0-0 zero, zero going into the third period. The spin has been really good, very entertaining. Just waiting to see who breaks that tie. I think if I had to say, i say Hershey's maybe got a little bit of the momentum there going. I think they maybe had the little more dangerous plays or chances tonight. We'll see what the uh, stats uh, show, though. Yeah, pretty even on the shots, even on hits. Time on attack a little bit for the Condors, yeah, which will go up a little bit more anyways because they're on the power play right now. Face-offs in uh, Waldo's favor, though. He's been really good on the dot tonight, so keeping at least 50-50, or in this case, he's uh, uh, closer to 75. I might have made that number up, but if someone wants to check my math, that's fine. <laughs> Start of the third, we're getting right back into it. 0-0, zero, zero. Hershey on your bottom screen. Bakersfield, who's on the power play for almost two minutes now on your top screen. Good clear, though. Going to shed about 20 seconds off that time. Seabus has room. Gets another tripping call. Hershey hopefully going to bleed a little bit of time off here. And they got about a minute as the Condor is on a five on three. It's not where Hershey wants to be right now. It's a big draw. Seabass wins it straight back. PD down low looking for the guy in the center is just kind of murking around. Seabass gets a pass interception of Waldo. Good play. Gets it the other way. 30 seconds left on the five on three. One last rush here, probably, for this five-on-three by the Condors. Seabass, cross ice, back to the defenseman, Petey. Down low to Seabass, tries to cross it in the middle. There's no force there. That's a good dump there. 30 seconds left in this PK for Hershey as Mino is behind the net, killing a little bit more time. That's probably going to be one last rush for the Condors. Big stop here for Hershey. Lukes does find it, though. Can't find, uh, Fisk can't find that interception and almost sends it to Smoke. He was just trying to make it back. Good four check though, and that's going to kill that power play. Wait, wait, good good moves and good looks by Hershey to come out of that five on three unscathed. You know, five on three, or rather three on two chance, and they go off sides. <sighs> Little breather here for Hershey as they collect their collect their uh, nerves again. Tie up. PD does come out with it though on the Condor side as Biss does get an interception. Gets a manual sauce down the boards but not powerful enough. Here comes the Condors. Lucas with a little wiggle at the front of the blue. Good interception by Down Smoke. Down in Smoke. He's at the point. Doesn't want to lose it. That was smart. Go to the Howler who was there to back his man up. They reset. Mino finds an entry. Gets a shot on net. And Stricky's going to save that. Almost halfway through this third. Still 0-0. Zero to zero. This is the hockey that you get when you're up in the higher levels. Smoke carries the blue. Still has it. Finds Mino. Mino gets a shot blocked, and here's a three-on-two chance for the Condors. Seabass streaks towards the middle, almost finds his man, but Howler's there to intercept. And there's a penalty on the Condors as Hershey takes their chances now on a power play with almost halfway through this third. 
That looks like, is that the center? Is that Seabass? That's a big loss. No, I don't think it was. Oh, maybe it was. Oh, nice stop by Howler. He's going to enter the zone just a little too early. If that was Seabass, and I think it was... They should be have a little advantage on the center dot. The Bears win it. Feeds it to Michael. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. They move the puck out of heart. Condors do get it out. About a minute left. Good pressure by Hershey's. He gets a strip though. Oh, there's Seabass. Never mind. So, looks like that was Luke's that went to the box then. Waldo finds Fist. And they're going to throw it out of the zone. They're going to get one last chance at this. Fist finds Howler, but they're going to go offside just a little too eager as Waldo. And that's going to be the end of that power play. Not much there as far as opportunities for Hershey. But hopefully maybe getting a little bit of momentum on their side. And another offsides call. That was close. Questionable call from the Zebras on that one, but. Nine left in the third. Tied zero to zero. Reno, nice pickup. Has some room. Gets a little bit stick lifted maybe, or just a little bit nudged by the defensive men. I think spaceless and just can't find a clean shot on net with that backhander. Oh, that's going to go straight back. Waldo wins that, but unfortunately goes off the boards and out. Smoke finds Waldo. They're going to have to reset here. Ice up to Fist. Fist Serpentine Root gets a download of Mino. Almost finds a back door off of the boards. Point. Shot. Good blocks by Condors. So they had layers and Waldo. And nice pass. They have room. Two on one. Backhand attempt. Unfortunate. Good save by Stricky. Great attempt there by Hershey to almost put a goal on this 0-0 zero zero tie here. Hershey straight back. Shot by Smoke. Gets tipped in front but saved by Stricky. And Spaces is going to cuff this one or rather uh, find that. As Seabass gets hit into the board, into the uh, into the Hershey Bears uh, bench there. Can't find the words. And a shot from the point, almost a dagger there for for Howler. What a shot! Another one too. As he picks it up again. Great, great, great forecheck by Hershey Bears down low. Fist over to Mino. Oh, gets taken away by Spaceless. And Condors are streaking the other way. Find Seabass, who has, or Luke's rather, has a little room, takes a shot. And the net going off the bearings there. Two minutes left in this third period. Both teams playing for the win, though. You know. A smoke. Smoke with a shot from the point. Goes down to Mino. And Spaceless. Finds that puck. Luke streaks down the board to Seabass. Seabass looking for a man. Gets holding a little bit too long and just misses Mino's fist on that breakout. As a unfortunate icing. Big face off here as it's 0-0 zero zero with 29 seconds left. Oh, good hit by Howler. He's still got it. Takes it down low. Holds it down low. Finds Fist at the point. Down back low. No. Smoke with a shot. Fist comes up with it. Tries to get a shot. 
And that gets blocked. Good layers by Condors. And a shot from the point and another block by the Condors. They get it out. Howler with a great interception there. And this one's going to be overtime. Zero to zero. No goals. First one to score is going to win this one. Big one for the Bears is they're going to at least solidify 2-0-1. That's a great week nonetheless. But they were eyeing a 3-0 and here. And they will probably not accept anything but... Both teams playing great hockey, though. Condor is looking to avoid the 1-1-1. One, one, and one. Time on attack relatively the same, just because of the Baker's Condors having two power plays. Passing about the same face-offs and big advantage here for Waldo. Let's see if that plays a big part and possibly an overtime win for them. Don't leave your seat. Yeah, this has been a hell of a game. Great saves to you by Carter back there too, even though I think he had one just really crazy save this game. It seems like every game he has one, but it's sometimes it's good to not be uh, noticeable. He's just making the, the right plays, right saves. ED. Taking it up for the Condors, and Howler's in the middle. Nice play. Doesn't cough that up. Waldo just misses the streaking Mino there. And miss hit by Fist. Seabass has a little room, but great play by Howler. Still has the puck, though. Seabass back and forth. Doesn't find anybody. You're getting a shot from the point, maybe? No, Petey brings it back in towards the back of the net. Reset, almost gets that stripped away and does take it away as Mino. This gets it down low. Too many numbers here for Condor's back already, though. And they're going back as a straight line fat load takes the boards as center, but good play by Fist. Great defense. Waldo gets it all the way across. Fist does find it. Gets it down low. Waldo. Oh, gets it to Howler. Howler at the point. Just shot on net, gets blocked, and Waldo a shot short side, turned away by Stricky. Mino up to this point, and another shot and saved by Stricky. This didn't get all of that one, but still a dangerous chance. Good pressure from Hershey's side to start this overtime period. Or check by Mino as PD just kind of twirls away from that. Seabass, and there's a penalty draw. Hershey's going to go on the PK here. Shot from the point. It's Looks like that was Luke's, but that's an interference call on Philly going to the box for two. Big kill chance for Hershey. You can kill this. You get that momentum coming out of it, though. Seabass wants it straight back and gets it to the opposite P, uh, Luke's rather, and he's going to finish that up. And Condor is coming out on top in overtime. They're going to go 2 0 and 1 this week. Hershey still pulling out a point from that game, going 2 0 and 1 as well this week. Solid, solid games from both teams, uh, that game especially. And uh, yeah, thanks for uh, fix, uh, fits. Uh, thanks for Fist for uh, streaming for us there as you saw some AH, uh, rather AHL action from the, I can't talk tonight, the uh, Hershey Bears. <laughs> After three games, man, my mouth is just fucking, I can't, I can't even talk anymore, but... Good shit from them. Um, hopefully we'll be able to do that again. It probably won't be this week, but maybe next week. But uh, good shit, boys. Take care. Have a good night.